Okay. So here we want to draw a circumscribed circle on this triangle. Can you keep quiet? And eyes on the board. So the what? first thing that we are going to do is to find a circumcenter. Are we together? We want to find a circumcenter. And after finding a circumcenter, we open our compass to any of the three corners because a circumscribed circle will, will, should pass through any of the three corners or all the three corners of the given polygon or triangle in this case. So, <clears throat> methods for finding a circumcenter. A very simple one. You just uh, bisect any of the two sides of the given triangle. Any of the two sides. So how many sides do we have here? Any two sides of the three sides. So A, C, or C, B, or B, A. So we bisect any of these uh, sides. Just two. So we have that one bisected. And this other one. It shouldn't be. So you bisect any two sides. So here we bisected line A, C, and line A, B there. And then where the two perpendicular bisectors are meeting, that is your center point. That is the circumcenter. So you place your compass at this point and then open it to any of the three corners. Okay. So this one is different from an in center in the sense that when you consider this triangle that we have here, right? This center can be located maybe somewhere in there. It can even be outside the triangle, depending on what type of triangle that you are working with. For example, you can have a triangle like this one. Have you seen this type of triangle here? So for us to draw a circle that will be able to touch this point, that point, and that point, it is not, it is not possible for us to have a center inside there, right? The center will be somewhere here because when you bisect this line, it will pass through there. When you bisect this one, listen. Let's say you bisect this one as well. So the center is going to be somewhere here. So that when you draw your circle, uh-huh. 